Hi everyone, we'd like to welcome you to our Friday, July 31st update. Wait a minute, can you believe we're no. ending July already? No. Going into August, which <laughs> means you all have to be ready for school That's and true. whatever that looks like. It's gonna be homeschool, private school, public school, and maybe you're gonna be doing it all in the same week. <laughs> so all the best for that, we'll be lifting you up there. Yeah. But August is right around the corner, and that brings us to our services for this coming weekend. Mm -hmm. Due to the high humidity and really good chance of rain, amazingly, I think we're going to be inside again. We're going to be doing 9 o'clock and 10.30, so plan on being inside for services. And really, it has just been awesome. Whether we're outside, whether we're inside, it has been absolutely fantastic. You can join us uh, live. You can show up here, and it's great. We'll have masks available if you want those. We have uh, cleaning stations if you want those. Uh, we have social distancing spots if you like those. Uh, not a problem, but if you mm -hmm. want to catch us online, you can do that on our YouTube channel. That usually gets posted around 4 o'clock on Sunday afternoon. Or if you're home, you can just join us on Facebook Live for the 1030 service. So a number of different options. Either way, we'd love for you to join us this coming Sunday, August the 2nd, right here at GBC. Well, I've got Amy and Barb with me, and we've got a lot of things to consider as we come out of the summer and consider what's going on in the fall. We're going to be making some adjustments to the current plan that we have going on during a normal weekly right. schedule. So, Amy, why don't you give mm -hmm. us an update on how you're handling kids currently during Absolutely. the week and then what this means for Sunday moving forward as well. Exactly. Well, sad to see the Zoom calls go, but we've been meeting with the kids Tuesdays and Thursdays at 2 o'clock, and sadly we had our last call on Thursday. So, but I'm excited because we'll be meeting in person uh, every other week. So we won't be meeting this Sunday at 1030. We'll be meeting outside on August 9th and August 23rd. And then we'll take a look at what that looks like in September, but really excited about August. So August 9th, August 23rd exactly. at 1030. And your outside stuff has been awesome. They're so under the fun. tents. You've got plenty of water, yes. plenty of helpers. Everybody yep. having a great time. Exactly. Uh, we have uh, a Bible study that we get to, and then there's crafts, different stations set up. So the kids are pretty distant and they get to choose what they want to do. They can do everything. They can do one thing, and we've got games set up outside, and it's, it's really a lot of fun. Outstanding. Yeah. Now, yeah. do we see any change with that moving into September? Or do you think, will we consider doing that maybe every Sunday I at 10.30? I would love to do possible? that every Sunday. As long as the weather is nice, we'll be outside. We've got that amazing tent set up and then a few other ones around. But that's my hope, is that we'll be outside starting in September, uh, every service at 10.30. Got it. Maybe add some more if we can. But for right now, just 10.30, you know. Exactly. Uh, and because I love winter so much, who knows? We might be outside in December. Just bring your coats and uh, we're <laughs> going to have a great time with that. Too. <laughs> it, it is. So we have a lot of good things coming up. We're just going to adjust accordingly. Right. Now, speaking right. of kids, they have moms. That's <laughs> so right. what is going on with the moms group? I know we were meeting Monday through Friday you know at 10 o'clock every morning that was such an amazing group mm -hmm. so amazing but I know as we get ready to change our schedules over to homeschool our kids and and we get busier I know that has to change and I know there's some changes coming up in yes. August so the mom's call has been wonderful mm -hmm. I love getting to know all the moms yeah, so true. but we've decided to go just Mondays and Thursdays at 10 o'clock and that doesn't mean they can't meet the other days. It's okay. just um, I will only be on Mondays and Thursdays okay. with them going through a study. And then Wednesdays, uh, Kara is going to start having the group meet up at church mm -hmm. in September. Okay, so they'll have that kind of connection also. That's great. And I know that there's child care for that time yes. frame too. Yes, so. there will be child care on mm -hmm. the Wednesdays that they come up here to spend time That's together. And is that a 10 to noon time frame? Is that what we're I looking at? Yeah, so. yeah. I yeah. So I don't know if the time has exactly been set yet. Right. Okay. That'll start. I know that the talk is 10, 10 to noon yeah. somewhere, but stay tuned definitely right. as we move forward mm -hmm. so Mondays exactly. and Thursdays for the time being on the call with Barb beginning at 10 o'clock right. and then going live and in person September mm -hmm. Kara's gonna have more information for us on that exactly yes. and so stay tuned now any thoughts on a potential Bible study for women in the fall yes we are in the works for that right now determining which study 
and um, just wait for some announcements on how we're going to handle it. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. That sounds great. Same thing's happening for us as well regarding youth ministry, middle school and high school. Mm -hmm. uh, Amy, what do we have going on for our middle school and high school girls? So again, very excited because, you know, I have a little bit of a passion for kids and teens. So starting this Wednesday, I'll be sending out some information. Four o'clock on Wednesdays, we'll probably go to about 5, 5.30, depending. We've got a young women's Bible study that we'll be starting. We'll be going through James, lots of crafts, lots of discussions, talking about um, just how things can impact their lives. And I'm just really excited about. So again, Wednesdays, starting this Wednesday, four to about five, 5.30, look for details and information. Let us know if you're interested, and that's for teen girls, middle school and high school. Great. For the guys, mm -hmm. we're still planning on something for you as well. We'll get you more information soon, and then we're trying to get the group back together, just youth ministry as a whole. We really appreciate the MUMAs hosting two uh, very recent pool parties, good attendance there for that, a lot of fun. We, I think we've got a bowling outing coming up right. and then a hike coming up. Stay tuned. We'll keep mm -hmm. you posted, middle school and high school. And Again, we appreciate everybody's willingness to serve and help out in so many different ways, including how things are being handled financially here. And we so appreciate your willingness to give. So Amy, mm -hmm. final update on that, and then we'll wrap up right. the call here. There are so many ways to give. And again, like Chris said, we are so appreciative. Just because things change doesn't mean that ministry stops. As a matter of fact, they ramp up. So we are so appreciative of all the giving and all the support prayers, um, just everything that you guys have done. So thank you so much. If you're unsure of how to give, you can give us a call here at the church office, or you can give online, go to our website, and that's through PayPal. You can set that up through your bank or just, you know, when you show up in person. Or if you're not comfortable coming on Sunday, definitely during your week. And one of the things that I've been able to do through the website is I've just decided to give, go to the route through the credit card. I'm not saying that you all have to do that, but since Barb and I had that plan, giving as part of our budget and we pay off our credit card every month, uh, that was an easy thing for us to transition right. to. I'm not saying that that's what you have to do, but for us, that also works. You can set up the PayPal, you can do credit card, you can do debit. And again, we just appreciate it. Yeah, absolutely. All right, we're going to wrap this up. Thanks for joining us for our Friday update. We look forward to seeing you this coming Sunday, August the 2nd, 9 o'clock, 1030 for our services. And we will be indoors this coming weekend. Have a fantastic Friday.